All right, he's alone. How you doing? How you doing? What's what's all this about? Um, let me just get the recording set up, and then um, we'll we'll talk, okay? All right. I got to do this all uh, proper and fancy, okay? Um, so today's date is October 23rd, 2023, time 11.03 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. I am Officer Shane Jones, badge number 630 of the Unified Police Department. Zolo, uh, a.k.a. your legal surname is, I just learned this, by the way, is Zoe Levy. Um, are you aware of your rights, sir? Uh, yeah. Perfect. I'm going to read them to you just so that they are on recording. Um, you do have the right to remain silent. Anything you say and or do can and will be used against you in the court of law. You do have the right to an attorney. Oh, if you cannot this afford is good. An attorney, this is good. be appointed to on behalf of the state if available. Do you understand these rights that I've read, the, read to you? Yes, sir. Perfect. Do you wish to speak to me? What's going on? So. You were already charged for this, okay? This is about the situation that uh, just occurred right here um, and why you're currently here right now uh, involving Carmine. Um, I, I want to hear from um, your POV exactly what happened here. Um, please walk me through it. <clears throat> well, 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 like what? Like as far as Carmine, like what happened? Is he okay? Zolo, cut the shit. I'm like three steps ahead of you. I already know what happened. Tell me what happened here. Come on. <clears throat> don't don't cut the is he okay or any of that. I know about the janitor. I know about Carmella. I know about it all. Tell me what happened. Um, I think... If you know about it all, then why are you questioning me, you know? Well, because this person's a government employee, and uh, I take uh, that to be um, serious. Does that make sense? I got you. You know, a government employee that's been in court a hundred times, always finding, always finding not guilty, you know what I mean? I get it. Government employee. Yeah. Government employee. Um you know, involved in some shit maybe you shouldn't be in. But I need people like you to uh, enlighten me about these situations so something can be done about it. Right? Mm. Does that make sense, Solo? So you want me to be a snitch? Is it being a snitch or is it saying what happened? <laughs> Would you want me as a police officer running around Scooping you up? Yeah, you know, telling on a cop ain't a snitch, to be fair, you know? Because, you, you you know, that's what you telling on a cop. You're not telling on, like, you know, a criminal or nothing like that. Yeah, you, you you just telling the truth about, you know, what you would consider, like, an op, the opposition or a fed or, you know. I'm going to fuck with it, watch. This guy fucking works here. Every time you come up here, what is he going to do? What is he, beat your ass every time you come up here? You know what I'm saying? What, and then what? You know, they pull out their guns, get up on the rafters and shit. Yeah. You see, um, what's your name, officer? Sean, right? Uh, Shane Jones. But Shane. I go by just Jones. Everybody Jones. knows me by Jones. Yep. Jones, we, 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 we kind of like the same, but on different sides of the spectrum. You know what I mean? You know, you, you, st you, you, you back by the blue. I'm back by the moral code. You know what I mean? And like, Respect. the shit you do, you know, you guys justify it. Because it's back by the blue, you know, something, something you stand on, you know, and, Agreed. you know, I got to stand on principles, you know, and certain morals, because that's what makes me me. Okay. So, you know, whatever you need to know about Carmine, I don't recall. Hello. <laughs> 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 so <laughs> if you don't like comply with me here that means I need to investigate this you know I don't want to have to go write subpoenas on your phone and go through it and go through that phone call that Carmine gave you and have to dig deeper 
into your life. Like this isn't about you, but mm. it's going to have to be for me to investigate this case properly. So what you basically saying is Jones, I know what happened here. I need to prove what happened here. That's what I'm saying to you. Like you've already been charged for this. I'm not, I'm going to be real with you. Like just straight keeping it in a stack with you, bro. I'm not concerned about really you right now. Cause like you've already done the time you've pled guilty to this. You're not like my, um, let's see my, my suspect in this. If that makes <laughs> sense. Right. Yo, I'm Chad, let me cook. Let me cook. Let me cook. I have pieces of a puzzle that I'm missing and I need to put that puzzle together. Does that make sense? Mm. So Jones, what you're telling me is you need me to help you with your pieces of puzzle. Correct. Mm. I could make this sealed. You know, you could do a sealed disposition. <laughs> if you wanted to go to court, we don't got to have you in the courtroom. We could have you, you know, testify to a judge where nobody else even knows you were ever there. Mm. But I mean, Mr. Zola, we are talking <laughs> about, you know, a government official keeping up Carmela. If that's what happened. I mean, if you would, you know tell me <clears throat> exactly what happened so jo jones um how long you been around like you've been around like how long you been on the force i've been around a long time man my state id is like 1200 mm. so you I worked up here i was command up here before the reconstruction and then i was here for like two to three months <laughs> and then i became a cop so i'm going on three years as a cop wow that's that's i, I respect I around, that though I took like eight months, just, you know, car, car. break, went to Tijuana looking for Bob Smith and mm. went to Bora Bora. You know, out there I had a fucking servant and everything. It was like I was fucking rich. Damn. You know, I, I heard Bora, about Bora Bora. Bora. It's crazy. Yo, that shit's crazy. I was balling out there, bro. I had housemaids. This shit was lit, bro. Hot chicks everywhere. Ooh. I was drinking fucking tequila, some Casamigos lemonade. That shit was fire. Yo, Casamigos my favorite. I'm not going to lie to you, Jones. Yo, that shit is so <laughs> fire. Mm. So, Jones, you mean to tell me you've been on the force for three years. Mm -hmm. And you need me to do your fucking job? See, the thing is, <laughs> imagine this, okay? What do you need to keep an ice cube from melting? Mm, you need some ice. No, you need a freezer. You need cold. Yes. Yeah. Freezer, right? So imagine this. I have an ice cube, okay? The ice cube is this situation. The more people I have to solidify what happened, the ice cube doesn't melt. The less people I have, the ice cube melts. Does that make sense? Maybe mm -hmm. that's a shit analogy, but I don't know. I just kind of winged that. No, it's, it's what you're telling me is a crooked cop wants to take out a fucking crooked cop. What the fuck does that mean? What do you mean a crooked cop? How am I crooked? Where did you get that? And you need me. Wait, hold to on. Fucking this help you. on recording, dog. I ain't crooked. Let's clear that straight up for the record. You see, Jones, I've done a lot of time in jail. I've done years. You know what I mean? And I don't bend, I don't fold. You know what I do with crooked people? I let karma, I let the streets handle them. So whatever Carmine's done, whatever you think he may have done, he, then it will be served. Believe that. What, well, by kidnapping his janitor? <laughs> dinner that's gonna be served and then let me guess. Were you driving or Mateo? Don't recall. You don't recall? Well, whoever it was can't drive. <laughs> the bison, right up into a canal. Y'all had to bail out of that bitch. Call Paris for help. <laughs> Paris shows up in a goddamn taxi of all vehicles. A taxi. We're talking about access to how many chain gang vehicles and she shows up in a motherfucking taxi. Zolo. <clears throat> And then y'all start busting out the taxi. I don't consider that too much of a dinner served. I mean, you're in here and Carmine's walking around. Acting like nothing fucking happened. 
I don't recall like, Jones, you know. Um, All right, we're going to wrap up this interview at 11.13 uh, p.m. <laughs> uh, ending the record. <laughs> I don't like my time being wasted, Zolo. I'm a busy man. I know. I'm a busy man, too. But, you know, Carmine, he's a crook. And so are y'all. Corrupted government officials. Yeah. You work I for the state. As, hey, listen, okay? That's like me saying every single one of... I mean, I guess that analogy wouldn't work, but... Listen, okay? Don't judge all officers based upon select, okay? Listen. I can be firm out there on the field, and I can be direct, and I might be the one who shoots out an S-14 that pitted me last night, <clears throat> but... <clears throat> That was you in the apron, huh? The UPD mm -hmm. apron? Mm hmm. Mm. That was me. You pitted me at 120 motherfucking miles an hour. <sighs> mm -hmm. Damn, you survived. Sad day. Yeah. Sad and day. You survived too because I have good aim <laughs> and I didn't shoot out you. I shot out the whip. I respect that. You know what, Jones? I do respect that because I, I was very surprised I didn't get killed because normally, normally, normally they kill me. And I was like, okay, he shot I out the car. I ain't, try I ain't trying to kill you. Listen, okay? We could be <laughs> oppositions, <laughs> and we could be acquaintances, but I ain't corrupt, and I ain't like these other people, all right? So give every officer you have an interaction with the opportunity, okay? Because they're not all the same. I hope you know that. There is good ones. Yeah, right? Bloom's a good one, too. Really good guy. I was there when you talk about the thing where he pulled up to the booth. I know you are blowing <laughs> smoke up my ass right now. <laughs> <clears throat> yeah, yeah, Jones. All right, all right. All right, Jones, I respect you. Like I said, you a man, I respect you, you know? Like I said, you just you just have a different way of living than I do. And, you know, you just got to respect the way I'm living because, you know, I, I, I can't rat, you know? I just can't rat. I get it. And if you do change your mind... This is good, yo. Me, all right? I got you. Uh, my brother. I, I get the fuck out of this. Probably, this. I think your time is probably up. I'm gonna be honest with you. I got. I got like 26 months. Uh, eight months. Eight months. All right, bro. Let's walk you out. All right. I gotta get out. I this do seat. appreciate the conversation, even though you didn't uh, tell me anything. I do at least uh, appreciate you hearing me out. All right. Yeah. Hell yeah. Anything to buy some time in jail. You know what I mean? Uh, hell yeah. All right. Well, you're. Uh, yeah. Let me just let them know you coming out.